Hello everyone, today let's take a quick look of our brand new wireless monitor, Cosmo M7. It's a 7 inch touchscreen wireless monitor with all professional monitor features. There are four shortcut buttons that can be customized to the features that you use most frequently. The four buttons are F1 to F3 and the exit button. At the factory, we have set F1 for peaking, F2 for three different grades of brightness, F3 for channel and battery status. And for the exit button, we have set it for false color. The whole system is touchscreen supported. You can even use your fingers to zoom in and zoom out. And also there is an on and off button for that feature. For professional monitor features, the Cosmo M7 supports exposure assistance such as false color, zebra, histogram, waveform, vector scope, and even HDR. And it also supports focus and composition such as single color, peaking, safe area, mark ratio, and audio meters. And it also supports 3D LUT import. Now let's take a closer look at the monitor features of our Cosmo M7. The mark ratio feature includes regular ratios such as 4x3, 2.35 by 1, and etc. The highest brightness of our Cosmo M7 is 1500 nits. You can adjust the brightness according to your shooting environment. The system supports fast channel switch. It also supports fast video images switch and mount several cameras. Of course, only if you've got a transmitter system set up for each camera. The system also comes with the self-diagnosis feature that is with all our Cosmo series products. You may also choose to turn on or off the battery notification feature. It supports time code, of course. What's more, Cosmo M7 comes with video display flip feature, so you can see the image from any angle you want. You may also notice there's a 3.5 millimeter audio out interface, you know, that's for regular headphones. So now the director can monitor the shoot with uh, this no compression and zero lag Cosmo M7 and can also hear what is being recorded from the camera. There are also a few notes that we think you really should know. Uh, the first one is there is a firmware upgrade that you can use your USB to upgrade it, the whole system. And the second one is you shouldn't keep the wireless monitor really close to the transmitter because they're, they're going to interfere with each other. And the third one is uh, there is a reset button in the system setting of the, of the Cosmo M7. So if you mess something up with the settings, you can reset the whole system and it's, it's very easy. And of course, we have the language setting. Sorry that for now we only have it in uh, Chinese and English, but uh, hopefully soon we will get more languages. Alright guys, that's all for today. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you have any questions about our brand new wireless uh, monitor Cosmo M7, please drop your comment below. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.